save a few thousand dollars at that point. Must be nice. But that is wonderful news. Good news for in-state students at Keene State College, Granite State College, Plymouth State University, and the University of New Hampshire. The university system of New Hampshire typically gets about $81 million appropriated in the state budget, keeping tuition hikes anywhere from 1.5% to 2.5% each academic year. But the two-year state budget that was recently passed allocates $85.5 million this fiscal year and $87.5 the following, allowing for a tuition freeze for academic year 2020 to 2021. It's good for everybody though that they, they did that because it's not cheap to come here. According to College Board, New Hampshire has nearly the highest in-state tuition in the country, second only to Vermont schools, with an average of $16,460 for academic year 2018 to 2019. The national average is $10,230 a year for tuition. The most expensive of the four schools in the university system, UNH, has an in-state tuition and fees totaling $18,879, while Keene State College and Plymouth State University sit just under 12,000 for in-state students. It makes me feel good that they're able to keep it lower, but I'd be worried about it being raised in the future. So it's almost like postponing it. Now the budget also gives UNH $9 million that will help double its nursing capacity and also create a state-of-the-art patient simulation center. Live in Manchester, I'm Sharice LeClaire, WMUR News 9.